Okay, so this is uh, me streaming video into Second Life. See, I've got uh, my media window here. There's about a 12 second delay, so I'm talking right now, but it's uh, not picking up my mouth just yet. This is just the uh, regular media screen that comes in your inventory with Second Life. And you can resize that to whatever size you like. So how we're doing this, um, you need two things. Uh, you need QuickTime Broadcaster, which is free, free download. And you also need to install uh, Darwin Media Stream, or, uh, QuickTime Streamer, and what that'll do is it'll give you a uh, QuickTime Streaming Server account, and then once that account is set up on your computer, you can punch that number that they give you right here, the server, and you can put that into your host name. Uh, in QuickTime Broadcaster and then you'll hit this button which will say start broadcasting and what that'll do is it'll give you this uh, RSTP number or URL and you copy that and once back in Second Life with your screen set up you go into world and about land sorry you can't see that on the video but let's window in this is the about land and choose movie from your media type and uh, in your media URL hit set and drop in that RTSP URL that you were given and uh, you'll want to change your texture to a image uh, from your texture folder that isn't being used anywhere else. That's what it's going to replace with the video. Then on your screen that you've created here, uh, you want to go into your editing features and on the texture, make that the same texture as, the, uh, as in the About World. Then once you hit your play media button, um, it should just start uh, broadcasting your video.